I wanted to show you guys how I make my winter curtains. I know they're not beautiful, but um, here next to the wood burning stove, a lot of heat goes out that window. So I took old polar fleece blankets and because they pick up lint and nasty and they're not very pretty, I took some old leftover fabric that I had and I just pulled these out of storage so I need to iron them. If I were to iron them, it would really help with this like puckering. But I have them all the way down to the floor. And there you can see the, a little bit of the polar fleece at the bottom. The way that I made these was I didn't go buy racks. I didn't go buy um, curtain rods. Instead of what I have is a little elbow screw. If you can see it. And I screwed it into the wood. And then I took a dowel. So this is a dowel because it would have been hard for me to get um, a curtain rod to hang in securely. So this has worked better. So I took and I, I have a sleeve and I, now that I've already done it, I would prefer that I have a covering for that polar fleece, like a cotton cover, because I don't like how it looks. I don't think it's very pretty. And um, so I would prefer that I've made a ruffle with the cotton instead, but I didn't. And so where I had the hooks, I made a slit in the sleeve so that the hook could come through. And then there's the other one right there. And the, the dowel just slides in. And, and those hooks are also the way that I hold up my, um, my shade drapes my shade uh, blinders in the summer and the reason you want the polar fleece is because it um, it's a better insulator than cotton and I do have pretty curtains in my house but this was kind of a bit of an emergency because our window was getting super 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 hot and then during the day I pull the curtains from both sides into the center and tie them with a string so that we still have sunlight so both sides just pull to here and then I tie them together with string. So, so we still have the sun and the warmth from the sun coming in so we don't have to turn on lights during the day, but at night we just close them back up. Wool, a wool blanket would also work. The reason I have the nasty wonky curtain rod up there is because I can't find my other dowel. And none of this was purchased. So you can go to the um, thrift stores and get old sheets to make the cotton part and the same thing with the polar fleece or with wool blankets and you just if, if you wanted it to look really pretty and really professional I would make two different sets of curtains the bot um, I would make a polar fleece curtain for underneath and then a cotton one for over the top and maybe have snaps that snap them into each other so they hold together better so that's another option